In 2024, history will be made as the Belgian Air Component Back will welcome the F-35 Lightning to Block 4. The first ever of its kind, Lockheed Martin, the proud creator, unveiled this spectacular craft to Belgian government officials at an exclusive presentation. Ceremony This inaugural F-35 positions Belgium on the path of evolution, replacing its time-worn fleet of F-16 fighters with a vanguard authority. A total of 34 F-35AS will make the prestigious journey from the U.S. to Belgium in the upcoming years. Admiral Michel Hoffman, Chief of Defense of the Belgian Armed Forces, underscored the significance of the F-35 to the ceremony's attendees. He praised the F-35AS potential to elevate the BAC's operational efficiency and enhance Belgium's collaborative endeavors with allies and partners in NATO, the EU, and beyond. Belgium's collaboration with Lockheed Martin's Essential Security Interest SE program imparts to the country a distinctive edge. This association not only allows Belgian engineers and specialists to familiarize themselves and engage with cutting-edge American defense technologies, but also presents opportunities for them to refine their skills and expand local industry knowledge. Notably, the designated AYO-1 is presently stationed in the U.S., where it undergoes a series of meticulous testing and trials conducted at Luke Air Force Base, Arizona, the cradle for next-generation stealth fighter pilots. This base also extends training for the upcoming lot. As the clock ticks towards an exciting future in aviation, Belgium stands ready to elevate its military prowess with the promising F-35s by its side. Is it Block 4? It's uncertain from the press release if a YO-1 is, indeed, the Block 4 version as per Lockheed Martin's statement. This question arises from Belgium's recent order for the F-35's latest modification. The U.S. was prepared to deliver the first couple of these combat aircraft to the BAC this year. Fast forward to this year's August. The F-35 specified as a YO-1 was assembled and exited the assembly line. At that point, Belgium specified it would only accept this aircraft if it was the Block 4 version. Concurrently, Lockheed Martin assured Bulgarian Military.com that Block 4 is exactly what the Belgian Air Force will receive without any a comment directed to a Bulgarian military.com correspondent from Lockheed Martin was channeled via a Bulgarian PR agency that caters to the U.S. company's needs in the Bulgarian market. Post reports by Belgian media claiming that a YO-1 and a YO-2 failed to adhere to the technical requirements of the block for modifications. Lockheed Martin clarified that the upgrade is soon to follow, reassuring Belgium that its specific order will be fulfilled. Modification TR3 The most recent update in the pipeline is the block for version, to anticipate it bringing a plethora of new features to the F-35A. This revamp encompasses the integration of ATR3 nuclear processor with an increased processing capability. Additionally, it features a panoramic cockpit display, augmented memory capacity, an updated radar system, and a robust electronic warfare system, Moreover, it enhances the F-35AS potential by granting it the ability to deploy modern weaponry, among other notable enhancements. TR-22 instead of TR-3 Lockheed Martin has revealed in a recent advert that it's enhancing its stealth aircraft, both for attack and defense purposes, fostering higher resistance to contemporary ground and air threats. The focus is on the integration and certification of the more advanced TR3 processor. However, this process is set to take longer than initially anticipated. The previous version had the TR2 processor. However, this lacked the necessary powerhouse for the upcoming block for modification. The timeline for completing all the transformations on this latest version has now been moved to the second quarter of 2024. The Belgian Air Force has clearly stated that it wouldn't accept the F-35A fighters until the transformation to the Block for version, powered by the TR-3 processor, is fully completed. Moreover, they insist on thorough testing and certification, as stipulated by the Belgian Ministry of Defense. TR-2 to TR-3 differences 
The F-35 fighter jet employs the TR-2 and TR-3 processors, each fulfilling distinct roles. The TR-2 processor is tasked with managing the sensor data of the aircraft, while the TR-3 executes the plane's mission software. This configuration enhances the processing efficiency and overall performance of the F-35. BAE Systems engineers the TR-2 processor, which is built on the PowerPC architecture. It processes data from diverse sensors of the F-35, encompassing radar, electronic warfare system, and the electro-optical targeting system. Designed to swiftly and effectively deal with massive data volumes, the TR-2 enables the F-35 to promptly identify and trace targets, whether airborne or earthbound. Conversely, the TR-3 processor has its roots in Lockheed Martin's manufacturing and is founded on the ARM architecture. This processor has the duty of running the F-35's mission software, which features flight controls, weapon systems, and communication systems. The design of the TR-3 centers on superior reliability and security, ensuring the F-35 can fulfill its missions with maximum safety and productivity. Why TR-3 is better? With its higher clock speed, the TR-3 processor is an improvement over the TR-2, bestowing upon the F-35 the capability to process information at a faster rate. This not only empowers the F-35 to handle more elaborate tasks, but also enables it to promptly adapt to alterations in battlefield conditions. Alongside its superior clock speed, the TR-3 processor is equipped with more cache memory than the TR-2. This valuable feature lets it accommodate more data close to the processor, curtailing the time required to access that data. Consequently, the F-35 can process information quickly and efficiently. Power management is another domain where the TR-3 processor outshines the TR-2. This sophisticated feature ensures efficient operation, consuming minimal power and producing less heat for a high-performance aircraft such as the F-35. This is vital, enabling it to function for extended durations without the risk of overheating or depleting power. The robust construction of the TR-3 makes it suitable for extreme conditions and resistant to intense temperatures, vibrations, and other potential hazards. This resilience means the F-35 can perform under a broader range of circumstances and is less prone to battling technical glitches or outages in the field.